I got it. I designed the arrow. The arrow's pointing to my head. Because it's the highest place in Indiana is in my fucking head. So now we will go to the next location. Because the lunatic is in my head. All your fucking problems Bring all your shit on yourself You show that you don't care much for others All the attentions for yourself Cause you're a big, big mouth belligerent You billy bitch Your cunt smells like a skunk Big mouth belligerent Fuck you. The objects that they find after anal sex are. If there's an accident, don't hesitate to visit the emergency room. And be honest when you get there. The doctors on duty have seen it all. Evidenced by their habit of sharing their favorite crowded anonymous pelvic x-rays and medical journals. Besides dildos and vibrators, physicists have removed screwdrivers, artillery shells, curling irons, spatulas, baseballs, flashlights, candles, vegetables, and a polyurethane waste trap of a U-bend of a sink. Sewing needles, salami, shampoo bottles, and assorted other utensils. For God's sake, people, there's no shame in buying and using toys designed for anal pleasure. It's certainly safer than grabbing what's ever handy. It's in the forbidden zone that I talked about. Because it's 420 today, and we don't care. We don't care any fucking more. I got most of that out of this Playboy book, but I do have some opinions of my own. And it's opinion of my own is, you take the stuff, take the stuff, and you put it in the bowl, and you light the fuck up, light it up, and smoke it, smoke it, smoke it, and it, and it. And the Logan. next thing, everybody Logan. just starts looking better. For some fucking reason, I can deal with children, dogs, and assorted other things that fuck me up. Amen. Because it's a fucked up world that we live in. But the alternative is I could be fucking dirt, or I could be that guy sitting at that fucking yard sale in the back of his house in a lazy ass chair with all his possessions out in the street. Now, he was looking at a comic book instead of a fucking help wanted sign. That's all I got to say, is there's a lot of people here that would prefer to sell their stuff than go look for a fucking job. So what can I say about anal objects? Well, a lot of things. You don't want to use a shovel. All shapes and sizes and dimensions and in dimensions and other things. I'm a ventriloquist. You see, I can drink and he still talks. <laughs> Every time we go and get some more of that, we like to just pass the motherfucker around. I could take down my pants right now, but my fucking balls would hit the goddamn ground. Somebody won't like what the hell we're doing again. Somebody will fucking complain. And I will sit there and light another bowl 
and say, hey, you know, I could be fucking insane. So enjoy your 420. I'd like to say more, but I looked right over there and I think I found me a slow whore. So I'm gonna get in my car and get me a nib. Hope she ain't got no fucking shit stain or anything. Boy, that fucks me up. I hope that her it's nice that Steve showed up with his guitar. This is really my backyard. I own all this shit. Don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do with it. House over there. Yeah, my house is somewhere. But I own all this shit. I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do with it. So if anybody wants it, they can come and have it. Oh, let me tell you about the comedy show. I took some. Oh, no, you'll see about the comedy show. Comedy show where it costs seven dollars for water. Seven dollars, two drink minimum. Seven dollars for water. A bottle of water. I got 24 of these for $4. 24 fucking waters for $4. And they want $7 for a fucking bottle of water? Is it going to blow me for $7? Fuck no, it's not. But that whore might. So I will go one more time and we will talk about Poobycock. And a long time ago, there was a place called Poopycock. Poopycock. It was located in a state of anus clean. And when it went in there, it made a noise just like a poopoo turd. Poopoo turd, that's a funny fucking word. Eh? <laughs> Nobody cares. The things they find after anal sex. Sometimes a baseball bat splinter. Sometimes, sometimes a, a wedding ring. And maybe even a can of cola. Because they knew ahead of time that that or was the best place cola. to put your wedding ring. If you don't want nobody to find it, shove it up your ass. No, Lou made it slip off. But you gotta admit that our creator had a sense of humor to put the shit house next to the stack bar. Slow because when you're down there eating, Slow you get the fragrant Slow aroma of the boo-boo. It's the boo boo again. It. And it Poke just comes it. at you. Like, man, smoke you wash your fucking it. ass or what? Smoke it and smoke who knows? it again. Who cares? And I I'll think we've been smoking. And we've been smoking. And fuck, I'm all fucked up, bro. I'll have to see how this turns out, because I don't know. But I just know that we tried and we lied. And someday we're just going to be called that we died. But it ain't today, so fuck y'all who did die, you lose. Happy 420. Fuck Donnie Baker, don't call him, call me, because he's not fucking funny. This is a rip-off. Water is $7 a piece. $7 a piece for water. Remember that if you come to this rip-off show. Marvels at what we do, even Marvel Industries, a division of Northland Corporation. Now, notice, go that way. Marvel Industries is for fucking sale. Anybody want it? You can fucking have it.